All right, third time's the charm. What's up, everybody? This is Paulio Jr. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to get rid of this uh, 403 error, uh, typically within Google Chrome. Um, so it could either be uh, you're on your PC or Mac, or you're on your iPhone or your Android, or whatever operating system you're using, whatever device you're using, it doesn't matter. This is all universal. So this is the error message that you get. This is a screenshot from somebody that I know um, who received this error today, couldn't visit any website whatsoever, uh, couldn't search anything. So uh, it would say 403 dot, and then it says that's an error, Google's trying to be funny. Um, and it says your clients not have permission to get URL and then whatever website you're trying to visit and so forth. So what I'm going to do is just start fixing this mess here by going into Chrome on my desktop. So it doesn't matter, it's a desktop application for Windows, it doesn't matter what operating system you're using, it doesn't matter um, if you're on a PC, if you're on a Mac, if you're on Linux, it doesn't It doesn't matter. As long as you have Chrome, you're good. But I will also go through the actual app, the Google Chrome app. So, so let's start with the desktop version. We're gonna hit the three vertical dots up here uh, on the top right. And then we're going to go to uh, history. And then we're going to go to, we're just going to go to history. So Chrome history. And all we're going to do is click clear browsing data. And then from there, something pops up here. And we just, it's already at where it's, it's already on the page you're supposed to be at. And so you don't have to go to advanced because you don't have because it's going to ask you to clear out autofill forms, save passwords, and so forth, things that you may not want to lose just yet. But you can clear browsing history, cookies, and other site data, and cached images and file files. Uh, click clear data. After you click clear data, just close out Chrome completely, uh, and then just restart Chrome, and you should be perfectly fine. The process goes is exactly the same with uh, the Android device, uh, or what Android or iPhone doesn't matter. So we go to Chrome. Yeah, this is cool. I'm using a Android emulator. Whoop de do. So leave me alone right now. And so what we're gonna do here? Same thing. Three vertical dots, and we're gonna go to history, and it should. It should just bring us right to the page. Okay, clear browsing data. And on that, it says all time, uh, everything is already checked, browsing, history, cookies, and site data, cached images and files. It's the same exact process for every single Google Chrome program or application. So, uh, and that's it. You click, ah, click clear, that's it. Okay, got it. And then your history is completely removed, so, uh, there's not going to be a lot of stuff that autofills um, unless you have bookmarks and so forth um, or things like your if you have a home page set and that kind of stuff but uh, yeah so all of your history will be removed uh, from that particular browser and if you are actually logged into that browser with your Gmail account that will be removed from your other um, on your other devices as well so it's not a big deal so this is a very simple fix just to be able to use google chrome again so because it is one of the faster browsers out there so i would say chrome and then maybe firefox is second so firefox is better at loading videos though so but uh yeah that's really all i have i hope this video helped you guys uh it definitely helped uh the person that i know who i'm very close with so yeah and that's about it. So enjoy. I'm out of here. See ya.